Hello everyone. I hope you like the video of interpolation manually. And as I had told you that in the next video, I will tell you that how you can use your scientific calculator directly for interpolation. So in this video, we will see that how you can use this scientific calculator directly for interpolation without using pen paper. So for scientific calculator also, we are using this same question. So first what you have to do when you will switch on your uh, scientific calculator, you can see a symbol of D as well as a symbol of SD here or any other symbol. Okay, so first you have to clear all this. You, uh, uh, you should have only the symbol of D on your screen. So for to reset all, for what you will do, you will press shift, then you will press mode. Okay, then you, here you can see for all, uh, we have to press three. Okay, so you will press three. You can see the symbol of reset. Okay, so you will press equal to. So now it's reset all. Okay, now again you will press uh, mode and you will press three to select REG and to select this linear you will press one okay now you can see the symbol of reg here on the screen okay now you will put the values so for 7.60 our displacement is 15693 so for 7.60 so you will press 7.60 then comma then 15693 okay 7.60 and you will this uh, use this comma okay it's about the delete button after this you will put the displacement that is 15693 after that here in the corner you can see this m plus so you will press this m plus so you can see n is equals to 1 okay it means that the first value is saved now again we will put the second value that is uh, the draft is 7.8 and displacement is 16161 so you will press 7.80 and again comma 16161 okay then again you will press m plus so now n is equals to 2 it means that the second value is also saved okay this value is also saved now to find for the 7.66 you will press 7.66 now you press shift and then you will press 2 now you can see something like this on your screen now using this button okay you will go till the end okay so you will find at this type of symbol okay so to select the symbol you will have to press 2 okay you can see here it's written 2 so you will press 2 so now you can see this symbol okay after 7.66 okay the uh, required uh, the unknown value so you will press equal to now okay so now you can see our answer that is 15833.4 okay the answer was 15833.4 okay let's see let's try it for one more question so uh, to uh, use uh, this scientific calculator for another question first you will press this all clear then again you will have to reset your calculator so you will press shift mode then you will press three to select all then you can see reset all on your screen so you will press equal to okay now your uh, now your calculator is reset so again you will press all clear now again mode then you will again select this three for reg and then one for linear okay again you can see the symbol of reg okay on the top so now again we will put these values so now th at this time we will use this lcb okay as we know that here the value is decreasing so uh, this is a, another another type of question so here first you will put the value 7.60 then comma then value that is 72.690 okay then you will press this m plus so n is equals to 1 it means that first value is saved now uh, we will go for this second value that is 7.80 comma 72.641 okay then again you will press this m plus so now you can see m is equals to 2 it means that the second value is also saved now now you will press 7.66 then again you will press shift and 2 so as you can see this type of symbols on your screen so you will go till the end Okay, so again you can see this symbol okay to select the symbol you will have to press 2 okay so you can see this this symbol after 7.66 so now you will press now you will press equal to okay so you can see our value that is 72.6753 okay so this was the answer so this is how you can use scientific calculator for interpolation directly without using your pen paper
so you should solve some more questions using this scientific calculator okay to get familiar with this calculator as well as with the process so i hope you will like the video so please click the like button share the video and subscribe the channel thank you so much